do a quick mic check. What's going on, Rope? Can you guys uh, hear me all right? What's going on, everybody? Feeling real good about tonight's uh, box, I'll tell you. We'll see what happens, but I feel real good about it.
What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome, welcome, and good luck. Get these gloves on here, and I'm going to go over a few things. We will kick this bad boy off. I feel real good about this box I was saying a few minutes ago. So we'll see. Let's see. We're gloved up here. Let me do a couple. Can you all hear me all right? Yeah, a little mic check action. The chat is so delayed for me. All right, great. Everyone can hear me. All right, let me get a couple test cards here. Make sure our focus and lighting is all right. We're looking good. We're looking good. All right, so uh, let me go over these giveaways real quick for the new people who have never been here before. First of all, welcome. Thanks for coming. Make sure you uh, like, subscribe, all that stuff. Promise I'll try not to mention that again. Um, so the way this works is, of course, we have the group break that's going to be going down. You know who you are if you bought in. It was a pick your fighter group break. So we'll be cracking this box. And we also do uh, some trivia questions. So throughout the box break, I'm going to ask uh, several trivia questions. And if you are the first person to answer correctly in the chat, you can pick which pack uh, you want. And then you just email me your shipping info to macycollectibles at gmail.com, and I will get you taken care of free of charge. Everybody from last week contacted me, so I appreciate that. Makes it very easy. So good luck with that. Uh, I don't think if you have a question, just post it in the chat. I'm sure somebody will be able to help you out. But that's how that works. So, And you don't have to have bought into the group break to uh, participate or to win any of these uh, little trivia things. And we also have the bounty. So the bounty is um, if whatever mojo gets pulled out of here, if we pull a mojo, the first mojo that comes out of the box, again, if one comes out of the box, that person hits the bounty. You have to be present to win the bounty in the chat. Uh, and the way that works is you simply just get whatever is inside of this yellow envelope. And that's how that works. Got my questions here. We've got top loaders. We got everything we need. Oh, I need to grab the box cutter here. And then we're going to be in action. All right, sorry about that. Here we go, grab my box cutter. Good luck, good luck, everyone. Again, thanks for jumping in. I appreciate it. And good luck to you. Nice sealed box there. Legit. Legit. All right. Man, I'm really hoping for a banger. I want to pull a color splash so bad for you guys. <laughs> We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. This is the best part right here. Ooh, God, that's gorgeous. I love the presentation of uh, the packs and the hobby boxes. Just looks great. Let me get these out of the way, make sure we're in camera. We are, we are. All right. Have I covered everything? Just double checking on my stuff here. Looks like everybody, we had one. No pay. All right. All right, we are good to go. That's my last box as a dud. Yeah, that happens for sure. All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Let's get our focus in here. Yeah, there was uh, some of y'all snagged some crazy deals for sure, especially if you hit. My man who uh, got Calvin Cater last week, that was probably the deal of the week. Congrats to you. All right, here we go. Let's get that first pack smell. It looks like we're going to have an auto right off the bat. Looks like we're going to have an auto right off the bat. Yeah, we got a low viewer count tonight. Might be a little bit of Monday blues going on. Jorge Masvidal kicking it off. Glover Teixeira. Nathaniel Wood, rookie. People keep sleeping on Nathaniel Wood. That surprises me. He's a pretty exciting fighter. Anthony Smith. And 
Jeremy Stevens. All right, let's get into this color here. Looks like we got red and possibly an auto coming. First hit of the night. Who's it going to be? My dog's going crazy. It kind of freaks her out when I talk to myself sometimes. And very nice. That's how we start a night off. So the Magomed Sharapov. Beautiful. That's a banger. Very nice, very nice. And we will look at to beat in a second. I don't want to spoil this auto here. We're going to use Jeremy Stevens to do the flip. I hope you don't mind whoever had Jeremy. Yeah, that's a great start. The beats, great card to have. All right, here we go. Here we go. We got an auto of very nice Tiago Santos. Sensational signatures, and I believe this will be numbered to 49. Let's check him out. Yeah, he is number three of 49, Tiago Santos. Congratulations. Yeah, that Zabita centered pretty nicely. There you go. Pay attention to the camera there. Beautiful. Congrats, congrats. And Zabit was 89 of 275. Very nice. Jorge Mazadal Fireworks. Cody Garbrandt. It's too soon. Too soon to comment. Diego Fajeda. Rookie. Nice card there. Alexander Gustafson. He goes for very cheap, too. I'm really surprised about that. He's got some nice cards that have been sitting on eBay for a while that people are sleeping on. Chaos Williams, rookie. And that concludes pack number one. Two pretty good hits. I, I like traditionally, just me, I guess personally, I like to uh, have the autos wait a few. But we'll take it. We'll take one right off the bat. A strong start. Nice to beat there. Nice to beat. Yeah, there's a few Jorge in there. You got, uh, I think, what we got a base of Jorge and the insert already. That was a good pack. Good start. Good start. We'll jump straight into pack number two. What's going on, scorecard collectibles? Thanks for showing up as usual. Drift in the house. Uh-oh, my dog's not too happy. All right, Donald Cerrone, Cowboy, is going to be kicking us off here. Get a little focus. There we go. Hopefully my dog's not too loud. Paulo Costa. Nice, Miguel Beza, rookie. Curtis Blades. And nice, a purple. We got a purple. Thanks, yeah. She's quite protective. Let's get a banger. Here we go. It's going to be Nikita Krylov. Congrats to whoever had Nikita Krylov. Looks like a silver next. And Alex Caceres. JDS, knockout artist. Cub Swanson. Mickey Gall. Brad Rydell, rookie. Rayoni Barcelos, rookie. And Alexander Volkov. All right, all right. What's going on, girl? What's going on over there? Huh? You're all right. There we go. I don't. I, I don't think I gave you the number. Twenty-seven and one forty-nine on Nikita. And as always, I'll uh, every card shipped will be penny sleeved, and all rookies and hits will be top loaded for sure. What was that? Two packs. We'll do one more pack here, and then we'll do a uh, 
a quick little giveaway. Oh, let me get that out of your way, dog. There you go. Uh, no Leon Edwards yet. I do not believe so. No Leon. All right, Askar Askarov, rookie, kicking things off once we focus in here. Here we go. Yeah, just like anything, uh, you know, whatever set is the newest is going to have the hype, but I'll stay away from all that right now. Amanda Nunez, I love this photograph. I think this is such a great card. Really, really happy with this card. Jack Hermanson, great showing, of course. They really did throw Edmund Shabazi into the wolves early. It's like what they're going to do to Macy Barber. It's killing me. Steven Thompson. Brandon Moreno, baby assassin rookie. There we go. It's a nice one. Looks like we've got blue. Give us a good one. Where's that fire at? Nice rookie. Kevin Holland. Very nice. Kevin Holland. Congrats, congrats. And a silver of Yair Rodriguez. There we go. Next, we got Robert Whitaker, old Bobby Knuckles, fearless. Who doesn't love Robert Whitaker? Zhang Wei Li. Sarah McMahon. Misha Serkinov and speak of the devil, Macy Barber. Macy Barber. Let's get these suited up real quick here. You pulled a Kevin Holland base auto in your last box. That's nice. I think it's a good auto to have. If he can stay healthy and have a long career, he could end up like uh, one of those guys where it doesn't really matter if he wins or loses. We'll see. It's looking good so far. I love Kevin Holland. Got to tighten some things up, though. That's that's obvious, but he's got the athleticism for sure. What's going on, London's Q? Nice silver there. I got to get some, like, uh, I gotta get some uh, like background music going or something, some elevator music for you guys. Nice card, nice pickup. Get baby assassin in here, just to be safe. We'll go ahead and top load that one. There we go. All right. What was that? Three packs? Yeah. All right. Let us do our first. Oh, my bad. What number is the Holland? He is 86. And Blues are to 199. 86 to 199. A freak is Jesus. He makes clickables ask you a question twice and you ignored it. Well, there's a lot of people asking questions. Uh, whilst I'm doing a break. So. If I didn't say anything, I probably didn't see it, or I felt like my answer would be too, too long-winded to cover it now. Everybody's just trying to watch the break. Not ignoring you. You'll be all right. Here we go. First trivia question. Remember, all you have to do is answer in the chat. The first one to answer is going to be the winner. And your question is, what is the first name? I'm sorry, what is the name? And first name is fine of the number 10 bantamweight men's the number 10 men's bantamweight is who where's my water and the answer is in it looks like i'm going to butcher this el drago el drago loop Answers with Marab, who is correct. Congratulations, El Drago Loop. My friend, you have just won the first giveaway. 
Just let me know in the chat real quick. Pack one, two, or three, which one you want to rip, and we'll rip it real fast and move on. Pick your poison. One, three, three. Yeah, we got to get some music up the hype level a little bit for me. Pack number one. Good luck. Uh, make sure that you email me at macycollectibles at gmail.com with your shipping info, and please reference what it was that you won. Saves me a ton of time. Here we go. You, my friend, are taking home for free a Zhang Whaley rookie card from Flagship. If we can get a focus. There's a X Fractor of 2011 Topps UFC Finest BJ Penn. That's numbered, uh, I think, 149. We'll check. And Israel Adesanya, 2019 Topps Chrome, 35th anniversary throwback. Rough Raptor insert. Very nice. Uh, BJ, oh, I'm sorry, 388. 223 or 388. Uh, shoot me an email, macecollectibles at gmail.com. You're welcome uh, with your shipping info, and we'll get you taken care of. All right, moving on, moving on. we got to get some... Some bangers in here. We've got to let me put that pack back. I've got nothing in my hands. Let me grab my little trash bin over here for all this. All right, there we go. Yeah, we need some some color splash. All right, here we go. Next pack. What is this? Pack number four. Good luck, folks. Good luck. Looks like Arnold Allen. Oh, I see a red. I'm kind of spoiling it. Brandon Royval, nice rookie there. I think people are sleeping on him, too. It's strange. He always goes for very cheap. I feel like he's a strong pickup, personally. Alex Perez, rookie. Very nice. Yana Kuniskaya. And we've got a red. We've got some 275 action. Gilbert says it's going to be Hamza, Dominic. And very nice. There we go. Nate Diaz with the 275. Somebody hit me with the screenshot. And uh, send it to me in uh, either Discord or email it to me, if you would, for the thumbnail. Hopefully one of you grabbed it for me. All right, very nice. Congrats to Nate Diaz. Nice 275. That's a beautiful card there. We'll check the number in just a second. Let's get this next hit. It's going to be a silver. Very nice pull. Here we go. Silver of Carla Sparza could prove to be very nice. Man, she looked good. She looked very good. Uh, Joe, I agree with you. I think it's very exciting. Jorge Masvidal, knockout artist. Very nice. Jorge showing up a lot tonight. Brendan Allen, rookie. Lauren Murphy. Vivian Araujo. Rodolfo Vieira, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu Master of the Universe, rookie card. And RDA. Very nice. Fighting uh, Paul Felder's ghost. It's such a. I feel like they went too hard on that tent. A little too hard on that tent. That was a good pack. That was a good pack. Carla, Silver, and a uh, Nate Diaz, Red. Get out of here. This is a strong pack. I'd take that. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Uh, Sean O'Malley, Jay Hall, I do not believe... That he has been pulled. There you go. Let's get Nate. A 
We'll check Nate's number. Of course, it'll be to 275. Beauty. One more look at it there. We got to appreciate good pulls when they happen or they won't happen. 183 at 275. Congrats, Nate Diaz. Beautiful card. Beautiful card. Now let me sleeve up Jorge. Brandon. The rest of these rookies over here real fast. There we go. All right, moving on to the next pack. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're not even halfway yet. Frankie, uh, I do not believe we pulled any Frankie yet. I do not believe so. Definitely not in hits, but I don't think any base either. It, Frankie, it seems like to me that even Frankie's base, like, man, I, I feel like I never pull that ever. He's kind of hard to get a hold of. Tim Elliott, going to kick things off here. There's the focus. Song Yudong. I'm trying not to spoil those colors, but I keep letting them slide out. Mahmoud Muradov, rookie card. Rob Font. He's earned a penny sleeve after uh, Saturday night. Danny Ige, rookie card. Very nice. Oh, 50K. Oh, there we go. There's a color we like to see, huh? There's a good color right there. Let's let the anticipation mount for just a second. Who's it going to be? Gunnar Nelson. <laughs> well, <laughs> I shouldn't laugh. Man, that... I'm disappointed. I mean, congrats to Gunnar Nelson for sure. It's a great card. That is not who I thought it was. But still a great pickup. Gunnar Nelson's a beast. And that's real. And the silver is Alexander Rakic, which everybody everybody was acting towards Alexander, uh, like how they're acting towards Yuri now. And just forgot once Yuri came around, everybody just forgot about Alexander. I think we got to watch out for that. Derek Lewis, Fearless. There's a nice card. There is a lot of Gunner. There you go. Magomed, Magomed Ankalaev, rookie. Very nice. Get a zoom there. There we go. <laughs> he crushed them a little bit, but we still got a lot of packs. I have faith. Yoani and Jacek. Nice face there. Saeed Nurmagomedov. I feel like we're getting a nice spread of rookies. We need to still hit a few of the key ones. Speak of the devil, Michael Chandler. It's a strong pack. It was a strong pack. We, I mean, I don't know. Can we really ever complain about? Yeah, we can. We can. We for sure can. That's a nice pick up there on that Michael Chandler. Congrats. As well as some of these other rookies might prove to be very solid. Investments. Oh my gosh, my dog is unplugging the microphone for the camera. Bear with me one second. There we go. Man, that would have been bad. Lay down for me, honey. Thank you. Gunner was nine of forty-nine. And I love the color of those, the teal. It's like a aqua teal. It's gorgeous. Great looking cards. Great looking cards. This rackage is a nice pickup, I think. We'll see. Will I be doing this next week? The plan is to do a break every uh, Monday. You know, just make this a regular thing, auctions in on Sunday. I, I might not do auctions next time. I might do something else, uh, some bite nails. But I'm also going to change up the breaks. I might do like a big lot of bl uh, blasters or like some 
multiple boxes of retail, something like that. Just kind of switch it up, let a little more people get in. I appreciate that, Mark. She's my best buddy. She's my buddy. All right, here we go. Luis Pena. Nice rookie there. Uh, he's scuffed all the shit. I don't know if you guys can. Yeah, you can see that right there. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Sam, smiling Sam Alvey. Michelle Watterson, another great card. I love that photograph. I think that's a strong card. Great card. The violent Bob Ross. Yeah, he's a little scuffed up. Matt Brown, Matt the Immortal. Put on a lot of great fights over the years for sure. Oh, man, we're getting some good color. So we got, what, a 99 here. Let's get something good. Who are we hoping for? Is it Israel? We'll see. We got that gold. That gold. Walt Harris. 2019 Chrome. Flashbacks. Again. We got a blue right behind it. We're getting some solid color for sure. I wish the, uh, no offense, I wish the names were a bit stronger. But congrats to who got Walt Harris. I'm sure you got in cheap and got you a nice card there. And our blue, searching for redemption in blue, is nice. How about that? How about that redemption? Rob Font, nice blue in there. 199. I'll check the number on Walt and uh, Rob after I finish this pack here. Nice Colby Covington, instant impact. I have not pulled a lot of uh, Colby either, which is surprising. Al Jermaine Sterling. Davison Figueredo. Marion Renault. Joaquin Buckley, rookie. Nice pickup. And little bulldog, Felice Herrig. I think when I finally made an Instagram sometime last year, which I don't hardly use, uh, people message me on there and get offended too. I'm, I'm from. I don't use social media and all that stuff. So like, if I don't respond to something you message me or this or that, I probably don't even know that that folder exists or I didn't see it or this or that. I'm not blowing you off, so please don't take it personally. It's just a quick little PSA there. And here we go. Let's get this Walt Harris in there. You know what? I do like the fireworks card. I, I'll have to admit that I was one of the ones that was kind of uh, a little critical of the inserts for Prism when they first came out. I was a little judgy, but, you know, again, I think that probably set my expectations super high because I was so amped to just finally have a new set to see what, uh, you know, Prism was going to be like for UFC and so on and so forth. But now that I've had a little time, honestly, I think these cards are so nice, and I think that time is going to do them a lot of justice. That's what I think. But yeah, so in short, yeah, I like all the cards. I like all the inserts. I'm a big fan of Prism, honestly. And I collect them too. I still do, uh, I'll always do one set for every set that comes out, like um, in numerical order, like in a binder, like throwback 12-year-old baseball days. Uh you know, I'll do each set like that, and then after the base set, I'll go ahead and hit the um, – what am I doing? I'm sorry, guys. I'll go ahead and hit the uh, inserts in order as well. I just like to see it all and, some, you know, revert back and kind of check it out as time goes by and have it all nice and neat like that. You got to enjoy it too, right? It can't be all about the money, the worrying about the value. If you have too much in this guy or this girl or whatever – you got to keep it, keep it fun. Yeah, that would be so sick to get a one one for you guys. For sure, or a color splash. I know I keep saying that, but I really want to see one. One, two, three, four, five, six for y'all. All right, let's do, uh, let's do our, our trivia question real fast here. Knock it out. For those of you who bought in the break and you like uh, – 
are totally annoyed by doing these trivia questions, I apologize. But uh, I'm sure more people like them than don't. But just so it's said, my bad that you got to sit through this. All right, here we go, folks. First person to answer is going to get it, and you can't win twice, so if you win, don't play. Uh, let's see. The question is, I need first name, last name, spelling doesn't matter, but I got to be able to read what you're writing. Who was the last person to take Amanda Nunez to a decision? This is a fairly easy question. Who was the last person to take Amanda Nunez to a decision? And it looks like we have a winner. If I am correct, yeah, it's Mark Tippett. Oh, Mark Tippett. Very nice. Congrats, Mark. With the correct answer, Felicia Spencer. Felicia Spencer was the last person to take Amanda Nunez to a decision. Congrats, Mark. Uh, pack two or three? Hey, that's all right. We can learn while we're here, too. Pack number three for Mark. All right, sir. Good luck. I'm going to be honest. I hate the way these silver bags tear. The other, the ruby and the blues, tear so nice. All right, let's see. We've got, this is, that's the Chris Cyborg 2019 Topps Chrome Short print photo variation. That's a nice card. Very nice, very nice. Congrats. And Habib Nurmagomedov with the 85. That's the 84. That's the 35th anniversary throwback insert for 2019 Tops UFC Chrome. Congrats. So make sure, Mark, uh, you know the drill. Shoot me an email with your shipping info. And please reference the pack for me. Pack number three. Congrats. Yeah, you're welcome, man. You are welcome. We got some more goodies. I think I think there's another banger in here. And I don't think I said at the beginning either, uh, if we don't hit a mojo, we still give away the bounty. We just take it to a trivia question so then everybody has a chance to win it. And it's usually the best. All right, here we go. Back to the action. One, two, three, four, five. What are we, halfway through? We are halfway through. We are halfway through. Here we go. I smell this pack. See, that's the problem. I haven't been smelling. Oh, my God. Man, that smells good. They should make a uh, car air freshener. That smells like... Fresh pack rip. TM. Mackenzie Dern, another great card. Love this photograph. Did a great job. I think it's important to appreciate when they get shit right. Great card. Looks awesome. Tyron Woodley, also a great card for Tyron, in my opinion. Demian Maya. He gets the shaft every time, but at least his face is showing in this picture. He has like four different cards where you can't even see his face. Brian Ortega, Shamil Opdurikamov, and looks like some red. Looks like a little bit of red. And it looks like a vertical. Looks like a vertical. If I can get that straight, here we go. And it is very nice. Irene Aldana, she's awesome. We got two divots. You can see them right there. You see that? I didn't do that. There you go. Other than that, it looks good. She's a great fighter. She's a great fighter. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I think we got a mojo. I could be wrong. 
So this could be a false alarm, but I think we're about to pull a mojo. You know what that means. If you are present and this mojo is yours, you hit the bounty as well. I think we got some mojo. Oh, <laughs> shit. My bad, guys. It's not. I thought it was a mojo. No, my bad. <laughs> false alarm. False alarm. It's a silver. It's a silver. Here we go. Just kidding. Just keeping you all on your toes. I said the word mojo and 10 more people showed up in the live stream. Maybe I should do that more often. My bad, y'all. Oh, how about that? Connor McGregor with the silver. Damn, a mojo. That would have been real nice. But we will take it. Congrats, Connor McGregor. This card's worth at least, not to talk about values, but this card's worth at least 50 cents. I can tell you that with strong confidence. You're definitely going to get 50 cents at least out of that card. There we go. Yoni and Jacek with the Fearless. Frankie Edgar, you asked and now you received. Yeah, that Connor Silver is worth more than 90% of the mojos we could have gotten. So that's good. Colby Covington. Michael Chiesa. And Yair Rosenstreich. Very nice. Let's go ahead and get Connor suited up. I don't see any uh, man. That Connor looks clean as a whistle. No divots. I don't see any roller pin lines. No scratches. Clean. Looking good. Looking good. So let's go ahead and get it suited up here. Here we go. Congrats on the Connor. Great hit. There we go. Now, Irene Aldana. Another good card. If you don't know, now you know. Yep, a nice Colby. I think I might have put him in the wrong stack there. We still got an auto floating around out there. That's nice. Did I put a... Yeah, okay, oh, it wasn't an insert. There we go. I'm going to move these base cards out of the way. It's on camera. Last sold, Silver McGregor, 384. That's pretty good. I don't think that's going to go down. Uh, well, I won't talk about it. Here we go. What do we got? Five packs left. We're doing good. I think we're doing good. Yeah, agreed. Great attention to detail. Look at the flag behind if we can get a focus in. Camera probably won't do it any justice. There you go. That's so sharp. Some of these cards, I'm telling you, I really, really appreciate Prism. I think they are uh, they really did a good job. There's some obviously some of the photos that they used over from years and years ago, and uh, some of them that are just shit. But overall, I got to say, I like it. There we go. Starting off with a real firecracker. Evil Eye. I don't even know if I listed her. I'm not sure. Drew Dober. Pyotr Jan. I think I might see orange or gold coming up. Alexander Volkanovsky. It looks, yeah. Man, we've gotten some good color. we got some good color in this box for sure. We've got some gold. Is that gold? That looks gold to me. It might be orange. I got the worst lighting of all the streamers on YouTube, but that looks like gold to me. Let's see here. And very nice. Jamal Hill, orange rookie. That is orange. That's a 99er. Beautiful card. There you go. Congrats, Jamal uh, Hill. Somebody was asking for him earlier in chat. So there you go. And, oh, we got a purple. We'll pull it from the top. It looks to be a featherweight. It looks to be a purple featherweight behind there. And very nice. Giga Chikadze with the purple rookie. That was a strong pack. That was a nice pack. We'll grab those numbers right after the rest here. Zhang Wei Li showing up with the instant impact. How about that? 
Yeah, that gig is nice. Nice pack. There she is, Tatiana Suarez. About to make a huge comeback. I don't want her fighting in Valentina's division, if you didn't know. She's moving up. And I don't want any part of that. I want Valentina to not take any more else of the rest of her career. Paul Felder, Lena Lonsberg, and Kelvin Gastulum. Sorry, there's one more. Mr. Tony Ferguson. That's a hard card to look at. Poor Tony. I like that his fans don't abandon him, though. That's one thing about this sport is like, uh, man, you know, the turnover rate's quick. And a lot of fans really abandon their people. And that can be rough for the market, etc. But also for the individual fighter. But it's nice to see everybody giving Tony his proper respect. There you go. Beautiful Giga, numbered 98. 98 or 149 on Giga. And Jamal Hill is going to be numbered to 99. Let's check him out. Nice card. And 79 of 99 for Jamal Hill. Nice pick up there. Let's get Miss Whaley. And there we go. All right, we got four packs to go. We've got some strong pulls. We still have an auto in here floating around somewhere. Oh, AJ, that's beautifully said. AJ's comment, I agree with it completely. Like, there's a lot of legends of this sport that, uh, and it's, like, cool if they don't know them. Like, there's nothing wrong with being a new fan. But it's the disrespect, especially in a sport. Like, this sport is all, all about martial arts. It's all about respect. And uh, it's just, it's disheartening. But uh, anyways, I'm sure you all don't want to hear a lecture from me on that. So beat Magomed Sharapov. Beauty, Augusto Sakai, another guy people watch or, or uh, kind of forgot about. Man, he's one to watch out for. He's got some sledgehammers for hands. Caitlin Chikagian, nice card. They did they did a good job. Her last card in flagships, terrible. Ed Herman, and nice Randy Costa rookie card. Randy Costa, uh, we got a roller. Let's see if we can. Get it and the view. I can't get it on camera, but there, it's got a roller line right there. Not too of a bad one. Not too bad one. And looks like we got red coming up. And nice. Kamara Usman. Man, we've been tearing it up with Usman in this case. We had a last pack or last group break last Monday night. Uh, our hobby box had a blue Usman, if I do remember correctly. We pulled a blue Usman, and now we got that red fire. Boy, that's a good card. That's a nice card. Congrats, congrats to Kamara Usman. Let's see. Oh, it's going to be auto time. I appreciate that, Joe. Thank you, sir. Hopefully you all didn't see that. All right, here we go. And time for the next auto. Good luck, everybody. I hope it is a banger. And it is Kamaro Usman, UFC champion signatures. I told you we were tearing up the Usman. That is some fire. That's a good box. Somebody hit me with the screenshot. I don't know how to do this, so I'm not on my phone. Hey, we're almost to 1,000 subs, by the way. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. We also do uh, UFC videos, and it really I'm just trying to get to 1,000 subscribers so I can start doing these breaks on my phone so the camera quality is a lot better. But uh, nonetheless, there is a fire pool right there. Kamaro Usman, UFC champ signatures. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, get that one suited up. That way I don't have to pay for it. Very nice. We'll take a look at her as soon as we get it suited up here. Man, he's got a great signature. Look at that. And look at the centering on that signature. 
Everybody's got Usman. This is a Beckett. Send this bad boy to Beckett. Get that 10 auto for sure. There you go. Give you all one last inspection of it. Hopefully somebody got a screenshot for me. There you go. Kamara Usman. Congrats, congrats. We got two nice autos and the Tiago Santos to 49. And the Usman to red. Usman came up strong. Yeah, it's been a strong box for Usman. There we go, man. Great. Oh, did I say his uh, 274 of 275? 274 of 275. Now we'll finish this pack here. Nice Colby Covington fireworks. I love Colby Covington as well. If you like fighting, you got to like watching him. Let's get some zoom action or some focus action. What's going on here? And there we go. And Alexis Davis, Jessica Andrade, and Sajara Eubanks, and Mr. Nate Diaz. Out of respect, we always put Diaz. We got to put the Diaz in the in the penny sleeve right away. Along with Colby, and then we'll get Randy sleeped up as well. Nice pickup there. One to watch for. What do we got? Three packs. Did we do all the trivia? No, we got one more, it looks like. Oh, Matthew. Matthew is calling for the gold Jamal Hill. Wants the double Jamal Hill pickup. Do I think Nate Diaz has a chance against Leon? Here's the thing about Nate Diaz is somehow, some way, he's got a chance against anybody. With age, I don't know. I don't know, man. Leon's such a good striker. I don't. I don't want to talk about that. I don't want to talk about Nate Diaz losing. But it didn't really matter if he loses, I suppose. But I don't know. Honestly, I think Leon is going to beat Nate. As much as I hate to say it, uh, Kevin Lee, Vicente Luque, Kevin Lee making his return. We, he's another one. Like uh, you know, he's easy to rag on. Of course, you know, I'm not saying he's not. But he's a good fighter, man. And he's coming back at welterweight. So he's going to be fighting at 170, not going to be cutting that weight. I'm very interested to see what Kevin Lee does. I just like watching him fight. I like watching good strikers, good fighters. Vicente Luque. Robert Whitaker. Bobby Knuckles. James Krause. And looks like another red here. We got another red. Give him a good one. And nice, yeah, your Rosenstroik to 275. Nice pick up there. Congrats, Biggie Boy. Who doesn't like Biggie Boy? That's a good card. I think this one will, in time, will also age really well, especially given uh, the market for Yair and his cards. Traditionally, I think he's a uh, real safe play, but we'll see. And we got some lime. Man, I tell you, we got some good color in this box for sure. I think we've had a really strong box. We definitely have. And here we go. Good luck. Good luck. And JDS, Junior, oops, Junior Dos Santos showing up with the lime. The lime to 49. Derek Lewis. I'm sorry, 75. I, I say that every time. 38 to 75 on JDS. Very nice. Derek Lewis. Love Derek Lewis. Did y'all see when he about flipped his four wheeler with the sun on it? That was so crazy. Let's see. Josh Emmett. Gilbert Burns, rookie. Very nice. Nina Nunez. Walt Harris. And Roosevelt Roberts, rookie. I got to pull out some more penny sleeves right quick. People forget how good GDS, uh, GDS was. Yeah, I agree. I agree. 
let's get these packed up here. Yeah, I'm gonna work out some royalty-free music. That way we got a little, just something quiet kind of in the background. That way when I'm not talking, it's not just silence. I wanna improve the stream. Man, if I can ever finish setting up my rooms, I just stopped talking about it because I'm sure you all were, that watch my videos were tired of hearing about it. But uh, when I can finally, I'm about done. I'm so close to being done. And then I want to start actually, I'm going to film the videos in the rooms, but uh, I don't even remember what I was talking about. I wanted to say something, but I don't remember. 252 or 275 on Yair. I don't remember if I said, yep, 38 to 75 on GDS. Oh, I was saying I want to improve the streaming quality, you know, up the up the uh, quality, you know, the presentation, so to speak. Make this a nice kind of Monday regular thing that we can do and uh, do some extra special stuff with some special guests. Yeah, that's right. We're going to probably have some special guests dropping in. And also, uh, we are going to... Um, do some big things around holidays, so on and so forth. All right, anyhow, we got two packs to go here. A little bit scatterbrained tonight, but we are going to do the last question now, the last giveaway question. So, again, if you just hopped in chat, you don't have to have bought in to win. Everyone can participate. The first person to answer correctly in chat is going to win the last mystery pack, which is number two. Although we've not hit a mojo yet, so you may have one more chance to hit the bounty. And here we go. This is a real easy one. Well, it should be easy. In regards to 2021 Panini Prism UFC, what are the purple cards numbered to? What are the purple prisms numbered to? First person to answer wins the pack. Looks like Derek Roy. Derek Roy says 149. Double check in. Yeah. All right. So, you guys, get a drink of water there. Derek Roy, congratulations, my friend. You have won the last pack here. We're going to rip this real quick. Make sure you email me, Macy Collectibles at gmail.com, with your shipping information and reference which pack you won which is pack number two matthew levin i was before derek roy on chat i'll check again but it, uh as the disclaimer i always state it's going to be dependent on my chat let me check here because my chat is all i can see uh no for me, it was Derek Roy first, Cam Quincy second, El Drago loop third. El Drago, didn't you already win? Shame on you. You're not supposed to play. So I got to go with Derek Roy. Derek Roy was first. All right. Oh, you're not a bother. Hey, I get it. If you won, you want your cards. There ain't no, uh, ain't no shame in that, my brother. No harm at all. All right, here we go. Make sure you email me and reference pack number two. And, oh, I see a nice little beauty there. We got a Rose Nami Yunez 2018 Tops Chrome Refractor. That won't focus. It's hard to focus. That's a good card. And John Jones' first and only Tops Chrome appearance, 2019 Tops Chrome UFC card. Congratulations. Email me, macecollectibles at gmail.com, and reference your pack. What was that? Pack two, I believe. And I will get you taken care of. Yeah, that looks like that was pack two. All right, so check it out, folks. We got two packs to go. If there's not a mojo, or if there is a mojo and the person is not present, in either one of those scenarios, we're going to do one more question, which I'll have to think of off the top of my head again. And uh, we'll give away the best prize of all, which is always the bounty. So we'll get to that. We'll get to that. There's still hope for some of you. 
Two packs to go. We need to fire. Where do you get those silver packs from? Do you make them yourself? Uh, I order uh, those silver ones, I believe, came from just Amazon. They are just like um, heat seal food bags or something, but they're like the perfect size for cards, so I love them. I believe that's where I got those. I usually buy things in bulk, so I forget by the time I need to reorder it. Uh, Tanner with a nice rookie card. Just dusty. Thought it was a scratch. We're good. Somebody wants some Cyril gone. We'll see what we can do. Nikita Krylov. Oops, let's get Tanner out of there. We already got There he is. Finally some. Oh, man. Look at that scuff. Ugh. We got Hamzat Shemayev rookie finally. And, oh, that might be. You might have some luck. If you get. If you clean this card properly, go on YouTube. Look up how to properly uh, clean a card. If you clean this, I think you can get rid of that. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but there's like a gnarly smudge that goes all the way up this card. That's a shame. But I think it's like real, real surface level. So clean this card right. Oh, yeah, that's, that'll come off for sure. Clean this card right, and you're going to have a, a good-looking card here. There's no divots or anything. And Kai Car of France. No, it's just a smudge. It's not a roller pin line. Kai Car of France. TJ Dillashaw. Yeah, I think it's in uh, good shape. I about ruined that. Sorry, guys. Purple there. And Jessica Andrade showing up, I believe, for the first time in color tonight. We got her base earlier. Very nice. Congrats. Nice pick up there. That's a pretty sweet card. I like the uh, photograph they used. That's awesome for Jessica. And we got, uh, looks like a silver... Insert behind it. And JDS showing up one more time. Was there some print lines on it? I didn't see it. I didn't see it. I'll have to go back and look. Alexander Volkanovsky, fireworks. Charles Oliveira, earning the penny sleeve with the strap. JDS, my God. A lot of JDS. Gokan Saki, the most marketed non-fighter. Cynthia Calvillo. All right. I already got some out here. Let's get Jessica. Suited up. What do we got? One pack. Still no mojo. We will do a recap at the end here as well. I'll recap all the hits real fast. I feel, uh, I feel good about this box. I feel like we had a nice box. We had some nice autographs. Some nice color range as well. Good color range and some good names. Who'd you have, Jay Hall? Sounds like you're not having too much luck this round, unfortunately. Been there. Yeah. Yeah, that's the way she goes sometimes. That's the way she goes. It's rough, I feel ya. There we go. Get Hamza. I'm really glad that wasn't scratched. Uh, Dan Henderson. He has an auto. Uh, in Prism, I'm not sure. I don't believe so in Prism. I could be wrong about that. I have not pulled one. And shame on me for not having that memorized, but uh, I don't know for Prism if he does. But he definitely has an auto in general, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's another good example of a guy, uh, one of the vets, who, like, uh, just no no respect. BJ Penn, I mean, I don't know. I don't like to get the outside the octagon antics involved. That's not part of the sport anyway. Nice pickup. All right, we got one pack to go here. Sean O'Malley, Sadiq Youssef, Uri Hall, Tyron Woodley, Shamil, and Alex Perez. So you had really strong picks, that's for sure. You had strong picks. But yeah, you didn't get a lot of love tonight. We'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. We still got another pack here. All right, last pack. And again, if there is no mojo in here, stick around. If you want a chance to win that bounty. Darren Till. 
Macy Chasson, rookie. We get that. There we go. JoJo Calderwood. Francis Ngano. We got a blue, it looks like. Let's see if some sugar shine. Here we go. Here we go. Give him a good one. Oh, that's not who we wanted. Ed Herman. That's who got uh, whoever has Ed Herman wanted. Congrats. Congrats, congrats. Those blues, man, those blues are sharp. I love just the deep richness of the colors they use for the prism. And our silver rookie is Jan. She had, man, a rough go with Carla. That's for sure. That's for sure. She'll be back. Should be all right. Uh, looks like Shogun, knockout artist. So no mojo today. Aspen Lab. There's Izzy. At least he's showing up for us in a base. Amanda Reba, Stipe Miocic, and John Dotson. All right, let me get this card suited up real quick, and then we'll do a recap of the hits. A pretty, uh, a pretty solid box overall, I must say. I know if you're somebody who did not get any hits, it probably doesn't feel like that. But as a uh, objective bystander, I got to say I feel like it was a good box. Personally, personally, one more. Yeah, it was a great color range. Jen and Marie with the sad face. Jason with the boo. Andrew Riddle says somebody might die. Oh my goodness. We're elevating things quickly there. Macy Chasson, rookie. All right, let's do a quick recap. And we shall see what we got. Way diverse box, I believe. Yeah, we got a Connor Silver. We got some good stuff. Here we go. Banger Silver. Get out of here. Ed Herman. JDS Silver. Jessica. I should probably show them to the camera. Sorry, I was just looking at them. Let me get this. Uh, hey, you're welcome. Thanks so much for everybody who came. Appreciate you big time. For sure. Nice JDS Lime. Yeah, your Rosenstroik red, Camaro Usman red, very nice card. Tiago Santos numbered to forty nine auto, forty nine right? Yeah, forty nine number eight. Camaro Usman championship signatures. Hopefully, somebody grabbed that screen for me so I can use it in the thumb for this video. Jamal Hill with the orange rookie. You are welcome, Stephen. Thanks for stopping by. Appreciate you. Both Steven, Steven Markley and Steven Chan, appreciate you both. Uh, Giga Chikadze with a nice purple. Irene Aldana with a nice red. Connor McGregor, silver. Rob Font, blue. Why, wow, that's not even in a top loader. we got to change that. Walt Harris, gold. Joaquin Buckley slipped in there as rookie card somehow. I'm not sure how that happened. Silver, Rakic. Nice Gunner Nelson, teal. Michael Chandler, rookie. Nate Diaz, red. Carla Esparza Silver. This was a strong-ass box. Get out of here. As I'm recapping it, this was strong. I'm happy with this. Kevin Holland, Blue Rookie. Yair Rodriguez Silver. Alex Casera Silver. Nikita Krylov Purple. And Zabit Red. Yeah, I'm happy with this. For sure, strong box. I should probably stop rubbing it in to those of you who didn't get cards. I'm sorry. I know it sucks. I feel your pain. I've been in your sheets 100 times. But, again, I'm really happy with this. I like to get a nice range of good fighters and a nice color spread like we got. And two strong autos. So how about that? Hey, we got to do a giveaway. We got to do a giveaway. Miguel says, weak if you didn't have Usman. Box full of some of the most popular fighters. Yeah, good stuff. All right. Hopefully you all enjoyed that. Again, thanks to everybody who jumped in, and thanks to everybody who came by just to watch. Anyhow, we're going to give this bounty away. Hey, make sure you uh, subscribe, like, and all that business for me, if you would, please. Uh, help us get to 1,000 subs so we can improve our video quality via cell phone videos. 
Yeah, every Monday night. Hey, you're welcome, Steph Bango. You're welcome, everybody. Thank you all. Honestly, I appreciate it very much. Otherwise, it would just be me sitting here talking to myself. That wouldn't be a lot of fun. So I love how many people are getting into this hobby and uh, how many vets have been popping in. Yeah, uh, Stephen, we're going to be doing some definitely some nice stuff moving forward. In fact, next week, I think we're going to switch it up uh, as well, do some multiple blasters or multiple retail, things like that. We'll see what we get into. And I still got to get with Baby Blue. Poor guy. I keep uh, – Send the messages, and then I uh, take, you know, 800 years to get back to people sometimes. I'm getting old and slow. But nonetheless, we're going to get there. We're going to keep improving this thing slowly but surely. All right, I've got to come up with a question here. And a question I think I'm going to ask is going to be oh, – this is going to be – that might be too hard. I need to ask something uh, very simple. We're going to ask a very simple question here because I want it to be something that everybody knows so that everybody has a chance to uh, win this. So I'm going to ask something real simple. First person to respond in chat is going to take this home. And I, at this point, I can't remember what it is. So hopefully, as usual, I didn't hype it up too much. Uh, we're going to say, uh, again, it's just taking me a second because I want to make sure it's something everybody will know. Okay, so this is going to be a really, like, super, super, super easy question. This is going to be the easiest win of your entire life, whoever wins this. This is going to be all about speed, so get your fingers ready. Those of you on a keyboard might have an advantage if you're on a PC right now. What weight class does Francis Ngannou currently compete in? What weight class does Francis Ngannou currently compete in? The first person to answer correctly is taking the bounty home. And it looks like we've got a winner. I'm just double checking. Getting a drink of water. It looks like the winner was Drist. Is that right? Oh, wait. Hang on. Hang on. I might be wrong. No, I'm right. Drist Durden. Drist Durden pulling off the W. Drist Durden. Hey, make sure your name sounds familiar. Uh, Drist, I recognize you. Yeah, you. I think you won something last week. <laughs> so you definitely know the drill. You're a fast typer. Y'all have to get with Drist and figure out how he types so fast. He or she types so fast. Drist, make sure you shoot me uh, your info again. I know you probably just did for the last giveaway, but do it again and reference what you won. I get a lot of emails and I'm horrible at checking email. So uh, as easy as you can make it on me, the better, and I sure appreciate it. Here we go, Driss. Good luck, my friend. For everybody taking off, I appreciate you again. Thanks for joining the break. I hope you enjoyed it. Oh, I hope y'all didn't just do that. I might have ruined it. I might have spoiled the fun. We got Frankie Edgar, Octagon of Honor. Let's get it. Focus in. There you go. Hopefully you're a Frankie Edgar fan. Nice to mirror. Ismag I said Ismagulov, but apparently it's Ismagulov. I'm not sure. I want to hear that out of his mouth before I believe that. I think it's Ismagulov. We'll see. Anyhow, nice rookie pick up there. And for your final card, it looks to me like it's going to be something from 2018 Topps Chrome UFC. It looks like an orange. And it looks like that's numbered to 25. Max Holloway, 2018 Tops Chrome Orange, numbered to 25. Congrats, my friend. Congrats, congrats. Nice hit there. Make sure you shoot me that information. I will get you hooked up. And that's a nice little bounty there for you. Yeah, you're welcome, my friend. Hey, thanks again, everybody. Uh, for all you new folks, please subscribe if you're interested in watching the videos here. I post videos here and there, this and that. We're going to be doing uh, breaks every Monday-ish. And tomorrow's my birthday. So make sure you guys mail me some fire autograph cards for my birthday. I would sure appreciate it. But that's going to do it, guys. How often do you do card breaks? It's going to be every Monday night. Every Monday night uh, until forever. We're just going to keep rolling through all the new sets, and every Monday we'll all meet here, and we'll do this uh, until people don't want to do it anymore. 
Hey, thanks. Thank you, everyone. Really appreciate you stopping by. Everybody, I'm sorry if you didn't get a nice pickup, but uh, hopefully a lot of you did there. It was a pretty strong box. But I will see you probably in a couple of days with a video. We got a lull in fights this week, so I'm going to try to get some content out for us to watch. Uh, do a little PC review as well. The PC, if I can finish this room up tomorrow, that's what I'm hoping to spend my day doing. But anyways, I appreciate you all. Until next time, take care.